Hartstikke, 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 ja. Thank you for helping us that song and uh, dance. Yeah, yeah, here, here we go, Matt. Be part again. You know, if you get someone to share, let's grab a tree. He was just sharing with me over right back here. You know, back in the, the 70s, 80s, the similar movement was taking place to defund a bank that was supporting very anti Indian individuals. They were locked in fishing, uh, correct? And uh, they came out, and I believe said one day, 30, pulled 30 million out of that bank. He said, if you don't fire this individual, then. Uh, our money's gone, and they, they got rid of them. So we can do the same thing here. You know, all your money bank accounts, get together, the city of Seattle, 50 tribes, you know, a lot of the gaming tribes also have money that uh, go through Wells Fargo or Bank of America, so we're also calling on our gaming tribes to uh, divest as well. The other thing I wanted to share, some of the people might have saw a couple days ago, there's a state legislature, state senator, I say, uh, from the, the Bellingham, Ferndale area, who is proposing a new bill this coming uh, legislative session. They want to target protesters, the things that we do. As a, a Class C felony for doing things that we're doing here. He's putting a bill in, and he specifically stated he wants to target tribal activists and environmentalists are doing the things they're doing against these coal and oil pipelines. So you need to contact your legislature to want to make what we're doing here a class C felony. We need to stop that. 